Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? This is LB The Realist with Surrealistic Studios. Surreal News, where the real is once again surreal. I told you I'd be back. <laughs> no, I'm on my lunch break again. I'm at work. So, again, you know, I have to try to come and bring another video for you guys, show my face. And we had Marianne Williamson just drop out of the presidential uh, race. Um, she dropped out. She was running as a Democrat in the Democratic Party. She's a spiritual leader, um, an author, and she had some really good ideas, especially around reparations. She brought that up. She was like the number one person who brought up reparations. She actually had a plan for it, even though I, I, I think the amounts could be adjusted, my personal opinion. Um, but there were some things I didn't like about her, uh, such as her Russia gating. I didn't appreciate how how much she, I guess, drunk the Kool-Aid of, of Russiagate, you know, it, it just, it, it baffles my brain how we have these otherwise great candidates like Marianne and, uh, Andrew Yang, you know, they're, they're so great on certain, in certain areas, but in this one area or one or a few different areas, they just really let you down. So that was one of the things that really got me about her, you know, um, <clears throat> but she did she did she did offer something to the debate um not only reparations but she talked a lot about having love and having compassion for people and that's something that, that I'm about too you know I I'm constantly telling everybody you know to spread the love spread the peace spread the light and she was one of the candidates that we had that was actually preaching that message you know she was preaching preaching the message of love versus hate you know and and I did appreciate that I did appreciate that, and quite honestly, I, I kind of will miss her, um, you know, on the debate stage, and I'll miss her, um, you know, just being in the race and spreading her message of love and her message of of what she was bringing to the candidacy or what she would what she would bring if she was president. So, you know, Marianne Williamson is out. I'm not exactly sure where her. I'm, I'm assuming. Most of her supporters are probably going to fall back on Andrew Yang, um, if not maybe even Elizabeth Warren. Uh, let me know in the comment section where you think her supporters are going. Um, yesterday I reported on the fact that, um, and, uh, not Andrew Yang, um, Julian Castro actually dropped out of the race. So the drop of light flies now. We're really we're really getting down to the wire. We're really narrowing down the field of candidates here is between Bernie Sanders, Joe Biden, Elizabeth Warren. And now we have some new guys. I believe even Tom Steyer is rising in, in, in some of the polls now. He's even ahead of Bernie Sanders. I don't really believe that, but that's what the polls are saying. Um yeah, that just doesn't make He's like in fourth place in one of the polls that I saw. It doesn't make any sense at all. N not at all. But, um, yeah, so people are dropping. Um, and hopefully, a lot of support ends up going to Bernie Sanders. She actually mentioned that, and I think a lot of, I think a lot of it will, but she actually mentioned that, at least I read in an article, that she didn't want to take away from other progressives in the race that were already doing phenomenally you know so again I hope a lot of her support does go to Bernie Sanders or Tulsi Gabbard Andrew Yang one of these progressive candidates um I'm assuming that's who she was referring to unless she's referring to Elizabeth Warren a lot of us still think that she's a die-hard progressive but all right whatever another story for a different day um with all that being said I don't want to make this one too long I gotta go get a new pair of pants from wardrobe because yeah <laughs> I'll let your imaginations work on that. But anyway, <laughs> um, until next time, love, peace, and light. I'll see you guys on the next one, all right? I'm out.